Ross Hauser. I'm a medical doctor and have been utilizing prolotherapy in the treatment and cure of chronic pain and sports injuries since 1993 here at Caring Medical and Rehabilitation Services. You're about to watch a prolotherapy procedure being done. During the procedure, I'll do the voiceover and explain the actual procedure. Prolotherapy is utilized in the treatment of tendon injuries, ligament injuries, joint degeneration, and meniscus injuries. Though I'm using the knee as a model, the actual procedure that you'll be watching might be in another area of the body. If you have any questions concerning this video or any of the other prolotherapy videos, please email me at drhauser, D-R-H-A-U-S-E-R, -E at caringmedical.com. Here you can see an illustration of the actual procedure of prolotherapy to the lower back. Typically, the lateral aspect of the sacroiliac joint is treated. Sacroiliac problems are the most common condition that's treated by a prolotherapist as it relates to low back pain. Sacroiliac problems can also refer pain down the leg. So the most common reason we see for sciatica, quote unquote, is actually sacroiliac injuries. So we'll also uh, treat uh, degenerative disc disease and that responds very, very well to prolotherapy. But right now we're just, I'm just doing the lateral sacroiliac areas. Muscles that attach here include the piriformis muscle as well as the gluteus maximus muscle. Uh, again, just thoroughly covering the sacroiliac joint, both the medial and lateral. Um, anyone who has clicking in the lower back uh, typically has injury of either the lumbosacral ligaments or the sacroiliac ligaments. Anyone who needs a lot of chiropractic care in the lower back typically has injuries of these ligaments also. And the best method to cure the pain of these conditions, I believe, is prolotherapy. And as you can see, uh, prolotherapy injections go very, very quickly. There's very little flinching by the client, so uh, even though there's a lot, a lot of injections, the procedure is typically very well tolerated. Here I'm now doing the various uh, transverse processes of the uh, lumbar spine. We typically do L3, L4, L5 uh, transverse processes. All the injections are done uh, where the uh, ligaments attached to the bone or the muscles or tendons attached to the bone. And I did the transverse processes. Now I'm doing the medial sacroiliac ligaments. The sacroiliac ligaments connect to the iliolumbar ligaments. Uh, the iliolumbar ligaments attach to L4, L5 uh, vertebral uh, bodies, so uh, you need to uh, treat uh, those areas also. You can see that the uh, procedure goes very quickly. It's very well tolerated. Um, prolotherapy is a very safe procedure, but you can see that I'm jiggling the needle. And the reason for that is if I was to tickle a nerve, it wouldn't injure the nerve. So you can see, though, even though the procedure is done very quickly, that the jiggling of the needle is done in case a nerve was tickled and it's not going to injure the nerve. Here now doing the trans processes and facet joints of L3, L4, L5. They can be done very, very quickly. Um, they can be done in the office. You don't need uh, x-ray equipment. And that helps to keep the cost down. And here is the last syringe. And you can see that the whole procedure took about three and a half minutes. And most chronic low back pain clients will respond to this type of prolotherapy. And normally you just need three to six visits. There you go. It's completely done.